Join me for some delightful summertime pursuits in the English countryside. You're invited to afternoon tea at a country club in Surrey, and we're going to arrange two wildflower and rose bouquets for my mother-in-law's incredible cut flower garden today on The Daily Connoisseur. Dear friends, Jennifer here, and welcome back. A yearly tradition when we visit England is to take the family to enjoy a British afternoon tea at a beautiful tea room. I look forward to it every year. We felt like having something familiar, so we ventured back to Fox Hills. This is one of the places we went last year, if you'll recall. I enjoy this restaurant because the decor is beautiful and exotic. Just look at this gorgeous mural in the tea room. Also, it's very child-friendly. We can all relax here and enjoy a lovely afternoon. I chose the orange rooibos tea again. <laughs> I think that's what I chose last time as well. It was all the familiar favorites. Tea sandwiches, delightful pastries, and of course, scones with clotted cream and strawberry jam. You know, the kids really enjoy this. Both the boys and the girls look forward to afternoon tea. It's such a fun experience for them to have a meal in this way. My essay for the upcoming fall issue of Victoria, the British issue, is all about afternoon tea. I just approved the layout and I cannot wait for you to read it. Henry James wrote in The Portrait of a Lady, under certain circumstances, there are few hours in life more agreeable than the hour dedicated to the ceremony known as afternoon tea. This is so true. It's a magical hour where time is suspended, whimsy embraced, and joy is full. It's a new morning and I can already tell it's finally going to be a hot day today. I love stepping outside for my first drink of water. I do this back in California and it's one of my favorite morning rituals. I love our back garden here at the flat. There are always so many birds around. I always stretch my arms out. You see me do this all the time. When I do this, I'm deep breathing and I'm embracing the morning and thanking God for another day. It's later in the afternoon and I was right, it is rather a hot day today, so let me show you my outfit of the day. I have a few fun activities planned, including flower arranging and notebooking. I'm wearing the beautiful white embroidered sky dress that I have been saving for a hot day with this gorgeous short sleeve duster sweater from Merci, the perfect summer cover up. I love how it has short sleeves, but it's rather long in length. It's a beautiful sweater. My bracelet is by Sky and my butterfly earrings by Nyrell. Brown leather sandals by M. Jemmy, and I'm ready for a classic British summer's day.
I'm about to take you with me to select the flowers for our country bouquets, but first I'd like to share today's sponsor with you, which is the wonderful Birch Living. Their 4th of July sale is live now, so be sure to head to the link in my description to check them out. Birch makes mattresses crafted with organic and natural materials that have been sustainably sourced. Their mattresses are free from polyurethane foams, which can cause harmful off-gassing, and are also free from fiberglass, which can be harmful for your health. Birch's Natural Mattress was awarded the Best Mattress of 2023 by U.S. News out of 340 mattresses and hundreds of hours of in-person expert testing. I believe it too. We've had our Birch mattress for years, and when we recently upgraded our daughter's bedrooms, of course we went with Birch mattresses too, because they're the best. I'll tell you why we wanted these for our children. Their non-toxic mattresses are made right here in America and are crafted with organic and natural materials that have been sustainably sourced. It was important for me to choose a birch mattress that's made with organic and natural materials because unlike synthetic mattresses, the wool in these mattresses makes it hypoallergenic as they are both allergen and mildew resistant. With your birch mattress, you get a 100 night sleep trial along with a 25 year warranty. The best part about all of this is that Birch delivers your mattress right to your door for free within the United States. They also offer in-home setup and removal to make your buying experience as convenient as possible. We love our Birch mattress and I think you would too. If you're looking for a new bed, check out Birch Living. Their 4th of July sale is live now, so it's the perfect time to upgrade your sleep with 25% off a Birch mattress plus two free eco rest pillows. Visit birchliving.com forward slash daily to find out more about this limited time offer. I'm making a few flower arrangements from my mother-in-law's garden today. What a complete treat. This garden is a cut flower paradise. <laughs> Not only are there so many David Austin roses to choose from, but also so many other varieties of flowers that I do not get in Southern California. There's so much choice that I'm going to have fun with this. When selecting flowers, I'm thinking of not only the color, but scent too, and what varieties will complement each other. What a fun, creative process. I've selected the flowers I'd like to use for both bouquets, so now I'm going to move into the garden room to arrange them. My mother-in-law has a lot of beautiful vases to choose from, so I'm experimenting with a few. The first crystal vase I chose was too large for the blooms I picked. So I went with the floral pitcher and a slightly smaller crystal vase. My favorite part with flower arranging is playing around and mixing and matching the different flowers. It's all really about a feel, isn't it? And it's a wonderful process where you really cannot go wrong. Each bouquet created is one of a kind. Isn't that a wonderful thought? Arranging flowers is a meditation in itself. I can feel my nervous system resetting as I do this. I like to look into the heart of each flower. It is its own world, so intricate and beautiful, designed to the last detail. And here are the two bouquets. I 
I think they turned out beautifully. I'm so pleased with them. I'm going to rest now for a bit and write in my commonplace book a few thoughts that I've been having today. Here's one of the quotes that I recently came across that I am writing in my commonplace book. It's by Ralph Waldo Emerson. Though we travel the world over to find the beautiful, we must carry it with us or we find it not. This quote encapsulates everything that I believe about travel. It's why I wrote my Madame Chic books, which really share all the lessons that I learned while living in Paris. My time in England is so special to me and I love bringing the best of the beautiful from England back home with me as well. Certainly I will remember this wonderful week with afternoon tea and flower arranging. And thank you to Birch for sponsoring. Their 4th of July sale is live now, so it's the perfect time to upgrade your sleep with 25% off a Birch mattress plus two free eco rest pillows. Visit birchliving.com forward slash daily to find out more about this limited time offer. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Keep calm and remain classy, and I'll see you in the next video. Love, Jennifer.